So hello everyone and thank you for coming to our session. Uh, Sandrine and I are from Nantes University, which is in the west of, of France, uh, nearby the ocean and the beach. Uh, we don't work on the beach, uh, we work at home at the moment. Uh, we work in the Pedagogical Development and Instructional Design Center, and we are very glad to be here with you this morning. Uh, the time conference is very short, so we invite you to send us all of your questions and comments in the thread dedicated to our session, and we'll be happy to answer them after the presentation. Now, oh, in our center, we promote pedagogical development and we're working on different axes. Indeed, on these four dimensions, we offer advice, support, recommendations, production of expertise, training and promotion. But today, we will focus on the professional development and a specific program that creates favorable conditions for openness and sharing. For the university, we are delighted to manage and coordinate the program OPEN, Ouvrons la Pédagogie sur les Campus Nantais. That means let's open up education on Nantes campuses, which is part of the development policy of Hoi Haars in the university. And we are very honored to host the 2021 Open Education Global Conference in October next year. For more information, you can follow the link on the chat and see Colin de la Higuera's presentation. So with this program open, we promote global commons, opening and social inclusion. And this program includes different projects we're going to present to you. These are some of the different projects and actions we could develop in open. Um, open Badges promotes the organization of an ecosystem for the recognition of skills developed in informal learning environments. Perform Knowledge connects professional development and art. We collaborate with the University Theatre and Paris Dauphine University. Access is a program that involves actors of different departments and services of Nantes University to move towards a more inclusive pedagogy. And open initiatives carries different actions to value, share and connect different activities and experiences. Today, we will focus on this project more specifically. So open initiative is a project who works as a cycle. The idea here is to openly share with you this cycle and the process that we experience with teachers, researchers, students and people who work in support services with pedagogical methods, skills, concepts and tools used in higher education. In this process, people can share ideas on teaching and learning devices like problem-based learning, flipped classroom, etc. To make it easier to understand, Elora is going to talk about a teacher's experience and how this teacher in particular experienced with others the process. So Elora, I give you the floor. Thank you. Um, this example uh, starts with a teacher who, as part of a course, uh, used graphic facilitation to promote interaction and learning. Uh, graphic facilitation is a method using uh, visual language elements uh, like uh, pictograms, uh, links, letter, letter shapes. And it can be used during a group work session and can be used individually or to, or to create uh, memor memorization and communicational tools. Um, uh, in February of uh, 2020, this teacher participated in an event, uh, and this event was dedicated to um, sharing and promoting uh, educational devices. In this event, uh, she came as a participant and didn't present what she uses for a lesson. And thanks to her participation in this event, uh, she discovered the possibility of submitting her initiative on the website. After this event, she contacted us and we helped her to publish and share her initiative. We discussed with her about uh, the key components of her courses. And thanks to our support, uh, she published a resource explaining a method uh, use of graphic facilitation. Uh, then in June, she agreed to participate in the university teaching day and presented her initiative to our colleagues. 
the very positive feedback from participants and the interest they showed um, lead her in October to run a graphic facilitations uh, training workshop for other teacher researchers. Um, the idea is that after this workshop, uh, the trainees experiment new devices with their students and then in turn, uh, they, they can share a resource published it on the website, uh, become a member of the graphic facilitation teachers team, participate uh, in events, co-create training workshops and so on. And our role is just make this sharing easier. We facilitate uh, conditions and create a virtual cycle uh, that we support with method to inspire and stimulate other colleagues. Uh, as you've seen, it combines uh, different moments, uh, events, feedback online, workshops, and a website. Uh, and all members of the university can be part from, but not only. Indeed. The website is only in French at the moment, but an English version is in progress because we collaborate with our European partners, seven universities and this project, uh, UniWell, initiatives will be shared using the website. To conclude, in the near future, Open Initiative website will interoperate with the national website in order to continue sharing and expanding. And uh, we can also say the computer code will be open source. Thanks a lot for your attention, and we are anxious to hear back from you after this to continue the discussions. We will link our presentation on the program session. Great, thank you very much and in time, so that's good. <laughs> uh, we actually have room for one question. Uh, yeah. Let me see if there are any questions. With pleasure, have, if anybody I, wants I, to. I don't see any questions yet. Um, but uh, uh, first of all, uh, of course, congratulations that you're organizing OA Global next year. Oh, uh, congratulations we are really to looking you. forward <laughs> to coming to Nantes. <laughs> uh, hopefully that all works out. But uh, it's it's a really a pleasure that uh, that we uh, that you will organize the conference. Yeah, thank you. Um, pleasure Igor, for can us. you stop the recording?